How to fit a night latch Before you start to fit a night latch, always take a minute to read the lock's installation instructions as measurements can vary. And remember, a night latch should always be used with an existing deadlock. Begin by placing a wedge under the door to stop it from moving. Then measure where you want your night latch to sit. In our case, we've measured 1400 millimeters. Mark this position on the door in pencil and then square the line across. Now mark the exact position of the latch as found on the lock's instructions. If, like us, you've a template available, this will make the process much easier. Just attach it to the door at the line you drew and mark out the holes you'll need. Drill the two smaller holes as marked Then using a 32mm flat wood drill bit, drill the larger hole. Don't forget to drill from both sides as this will prevent the wood from splitting. When you've cleared away any excess wood, place the cylinder through the securing ring and insert it into the hole in the door. Make a mark on the connecting bar where it will need to be cut. Again, check the manufacturer's instructions to see just how far the connecting bar should protrude through the door. You could use a hacksaw to cut the connecting bar, but we find it easier to make use of the little grooves and using two pairs of pliers, snap the bar to the length you need. Before fitting the mounting plate, make sure the notch on the rotatable cam follower is aligned with the connecting bar. Then place over the bar and attach to the door. Next, you'll need to secure the cylinder to the mounting plate using the connecting screws. Before you do, check the length of these screws against your door. For doors less than 54mm thick, you may need to shorten the screws using a hacksaw. Rotate the cam so the screw holes are clear. Then use the connecting screws to secure the cylinder. Now you can place the lock case over the mounting plate, ensuring that it sits flush with the edge of the door. Secure the lock case to the mounting plate using the two screws provided. Now close the door and using the lock case as a guide, mark the position of the staple, sometimes also known as the keep, on the door frame. Draw around the staple on the door frame. Then use these markings to chisel out a recess on the door frame. When the recess is done, put the staple in place and check it sits flush with the door frame. If it is, use a small drill bit to pre-drill some pilot holes for your screws. Pre-drilling will help avoid splitting the wood. Then fix the staple in place with the screws. Finally, check that the door closes and the latch works as it should, and the job is complete. To purchase any of the materials seen here, or to find more how-to videos, visit safe.co.uk. Thanks for watching.